from Painted, and today we're going to talk about Miss Mustard Seed's Clear Tough Coat. Now, this product can be used in more ways than what you think. Um, normally, it is advertised to seal paint, such as very chippy milk paint or high traffic surfaces, such as you know kitchen tabletops or something that's going to be washed daily. But one thing I want to show you guys today is not only can this seal porous paints like chalk style or milk paints, but it can also be used to seal in lead based paint. So for example, what I'm going to be painting today is lead paint and um, I love the finish. It has its natural aged paint and it looks beautiful. However, to ensure that that paint is safe for my family, I want to seal it so that it doesn't chip off, you know, releasing that dust that's harmful. So this product can be used as a sealant, like you traditionally would use it for, but also used to seal lead paint. So let me show you guys exactly how to use it. Okay, so whenever you're using this product, one important key tip is to put your bottle upside down for at least 10 minutes prior to using it. And the reason is all the matting agents, because this dries to a clear matte finish, but all of the matting agents tend to settle because they're heavier at the bottom of your bottle. So if I were to just go ahead and start applying this, it might have a shinier finish than what's desired because those matting agents are down here. So go ahead and put it upside down for at least 10 minutes. And then prior to using it, go ahead and give it a swirl like this. You never wanna shake up this product, otherwise you're gonna get air bubbles in your finish. So that's a helpful hint for you. Now, the one I'm working with has been upside down for quite some time. So I'm gonna do the exact same thing. And you can tell my seal wasn't perfect, so I just dripped it all over my hands, but that's okay because this is a water-based product. So it's easy soap and water cleanup. So I'm just gonna go ahead and squirt some on a plate and then I'm gonna be using a synthetic bristle brush to go ahead and apply it to my surface. Now, because this is a lead paint, I've already cleaned it with TSP and water, so it's ready to go ahead and be um, top coated, but with this product, you can wipe it on, you can use a sponge. I prefer to use a rolled up damp microfiber cloth, but in the event like this, where I don't want to disturb this paint anymore because I know this paint is toxic, I'm gonna go ahead and brush it on. Now, a key point too is to make sure that you put it on in thin layers because even though it is non-yellowing, if I put it on too thick and there's areas that pool, such as like where I just first you know, started, I'm gonna even this out, but if I were to let it sit there without having a nice thin layer, as it dries, that area is gonna look a little bit yellow. Even though it's non-yellowing, whenever you're using a um, water-based top coat, if you apply too much, then it'll tend to have a little bit of a yellow hue. So you wanna just put it on very even and another key is to put it on and walk away and try to avoid you know, going over it again and again and again. Now this surface um, is gonna hide any flaws if I were to overbrush it because the paint is so um, already aged and crackled, I wouldn't notice it. But in the event that this was like a smooth finish and I wanted like a smooth flawless finish, I wouldn't want to be continuously going over the same area over and over again. Otherwise, I can create some hazing that way because this product does dry very fast. And when I continuously go over it, it'll create a little bit of like brush strokes and texture. So right now, my main focus is just to make sure that I don't have any areas that are pooling and that um, my surface is covered so that I'm sealing in um, this paint. And that's it. And I'll probably, because I know this is lead paint, I'll probably go ahead, allow this to dry, and then just put one more layer on it just for some added protection. But that shows you how easy it is to use Miss Mustard Seeds Clear Tough Coat and that you can use it for more than just sealing our porous paints. 